Jimmy is in such a great mood right now. I'm not in a bad mood. I was <laughs> <laughs> just telling him he's, he's in a bad mood. He's trying to convince me that he's in a great mood. Every Sunday morning. Does this happen to you guys if you go to church? Is Sunday morning always tough <laughs> to find you're happy? I think because we're trying to get out the door, have everybody look nice. Although, I'm ready to start foregoing the whole looking nice just to get out the door in time and have my husband be in a good mood. <laughs> but we're all together because he's not teaching Sunday school this morning, so he's just leading the children's church worship. But we still needed to get there a few minutes early, which he stresses out about. And Taylor was having obedience issues. We're having an issue with immediate obedience, right? Yeah. And we have this saying that we heard from a friend that delayed obedience is disobedience. And we use that a lot, but it doesn't seem to stick. <laughs> so I don't know if you guys have any... Well, I almost want to us. add to it that slow moving obedience isn't adequate obedience. <laughs> Let's say run, hurry, and do this, and then he walks super slow. It drives me crazy. Parenting is exhausting. It's awesome and exhausting. Anyway, um, so let me just tell you about my makeup since I'm sure Jimmy was wondering what I was wearing. I'm wearing the Lorac, no I'm not. I'm wearing the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation with the City Cosmetics Pore Minimizing Primer underneath. And I have the Lorac um, Pro To Go Palette on my eyes. I have like a little swollen spot here. I'm not sure what's going on there. Um, so you can see that I just have the shimmer shade on my lid and the matte shade in my crease. I have the Kardashian Chroma Stick underneath to make it a little more smoky. And my eyeliner is the Physician's Formula 2-in-1 Lash Boosting Liquid Liner. And my mascara is the Jordana Best Lash Extreme. And then my lipstick is the Bite Beauty. I have it with me, I think in violet. And then I just put a little bit of this color over it to make it more pink and less purple. And then I'll try, I'm going to start trying to do outfit posts on my blog, especially because I actually get dressed cute, I think, on Sundays. But I'm wearing just this little blouse and some pleated, not pleated, I don't really know how to explain the pants, but I'll take a picture. And the kids are going to my best friend's house for the day. And Jimmy and I are going to have our first date day in probably six months. Isn't that crazy? That we haven't normal. been alone and done something together in six months. That's sad. No, well, we had... We had London. Yeah, when was that? That was in March. April, May, June, July, Five months. August. Five months. Okay, my arm's getting tired and we're almost to church, so see ya. It's Sunday and I just got a package, weirdly, that came today. And then I wanted to show you the Ipsy bag that came yesterday. So, um, in my Amazon order, I got the... Maui Vera, and this is Organic Sunburn Relief and After Sun Moisturizer. I brought this to bring with us on our vacation. I actually ordered those face razors, but they didn't come, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. But I'm gonna test this out. I heard good things about this, so hopefully it works. Hopefully we don't actually need it. And then my Ipsy bag is this cute orange polka dot one. Um, I have this Urban Decay Bigger Blacker Batter. This looks like a mascara. So that came. And then inside the bag, we have a Glam Glow Mask, which I've 
probably the only YouTuber who's never done a Glam Glow mask. So I'll let you guys know how that one works out. Then we have this Mana Sheer Glow Shimmer Lotion. Your The Balm Green Apple Lip Balm by Absolute. And the last product is Lord and Berry, a coal black eyeliner. That's a little sample size one. Lordandberry.com. And that's about it. So it was okay. That's an okay bag. It's um there's nothing full size, I don't think. Maybe this is full size. So yeah, not my favorite bag, but not bad. This might be fun to try. I don't really need it any more black eyeliners. But this I'm excited because, you know, i got to keep up. Just kidding, I don't really have to. But I did want to see what the whole excitement is about this mask. So yeah, so that's my mail today. Hey guys, it's Sunday, and I'm hanging out in our sauna bedroom right now. Oh my gosh, it's like 100 degrees in here, do you think? Do you want to see how hot it is up here? We don't have air conditioning. I know you know this if you watched our blog, our vlogs. I can speak, but oh my gosh, you guys, it's brutal. We are dying. I just can't live without air conditioning anymore. We need a new house. It's 82 in the hallway, but it feels way cooler mm. in the hallway than in our room. Yeah, there's something about our room. Well, the sun's coming in. So. so, um, I spent the entire day today. Oh, my bangs. Filming my videos. She can be in here. It's fine. Um, filming my videos for the momologues and for YouTube. And they went to church. I skipped it this morning. But it, Jimmy said it was really good. So I'm going to definitely. I mean, I always listen if I Man, miss church. But it was good. I'm going to have to watch it. If you want to, if, if, if anybody wants to just get a quick kind of blurb on kind of what maybe some of what we talked about was. Look up Francis Chan, lukewarm and loving it. There you go. Or you can watch our pastor's message. You should always, if you don't have a good church and you're like, I wish we had a good church, you could go to our church online. Did you know you could watch our whole, what am I trying to say? Our whole church. Every, every sermon is online. You need to come closer. Oh, it's just so hot. I know. Don't touch me, though. Make I sure know. we're not touching. Don't let touching. your body heat get onto me. That's almost too close. I felt your heat. Okay, that's better. Yeah, <laughs> search for Barabbas Road Church, San Diego, and then you can look at all the sermons. They've mm -hmm. been so You can good. watch them. You can watch them all. We're going through Hebrews right now. Yeah. And it's like, oh, snap, he just told me. Yeah, he me. goes through whole books in, in great detail, so he's... He finished up Matthew recently and started in Hebrews. Yeah. This Hebrews stuff. one is really good. And so anyway. showed the Francis Chan video at the very end. It's like a three-minute thing. Lukewarm and loving it. And man. You're sweating, huh? I'm super sweaty. Yeah, it's good so stuff. Now, now that I filmed all my videos, I, um, I'm a little bit depressed. And so I'm going to go work out. I got on the scale this morning, and I knew things weren't good, but I didn't, I just didn't know. I just didn't know. And I know it's that time of the month, that's what he's thinking, I can read that brain right there. But still, it's just, this time last month, I was not up this much on the scale. Not that the scale determines everything, I know, I know. But I, my eating has not been on point. I have not been making good choices, I've been snacking a lot at night. So, um, I think you might have gained like one or two pounds of leg muscle doing your hit. No, workouts. there's that. I can see it. I just got to figure things out because I can't be on a diet forever. I need to find, I need to live a life of balance, but I don't want to, my body just wants to gain weight no matter what. It's so annoying. Mine wants to lose weight all the Jimmy time. Jimmy just eats whatever he got. Would you not rub it in? No, but it's a problem for me because guys... They want to be buff instead of skinny, but then if I'm not like working really hard all the time, I just get skinnier and skinnier. It's a huge problem. Big problem. I wish I had that problem, actually. <laughs> <laughs> 
So now that it's 85 degrees in our house, I'm going to go get my workout clothes on and work out so I can get that done. Um, let's just go over my makeup since Jimmy was just about to ask me what I'm wearing today. Um, I'm wearing the City Cosmetics Pore Minimizing Primer with the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. And I have the Josie Moran Argon Illuminator. I've actually been wearing that the last couple times and forgot to mention it. Um, I'm wearing the City Lips Liquid Lipstick, the purplish color. And then on my cheeks for the blush, which this has been on for a long time today, so it's not looking as nice as it was in the beginning of the day. But this is the BH Cosmetics. It's the light and the dark, dark pink color in their 10 blush palette. And then for my eyes, I'm wearing on my lids the Stila Antiqued Black Gold Shadow on my lids. And in the crease, I have MAC. It's, I forget the color, but it's like a rustic, rusty brown color. And then underneath, I have the Kardashian Chroma Stick, the, the bronzy color that I talk about a lot. My inner um, waterline is the YSL Faux Sills Liner. My top liner is the Physician's Formula 2-in-1 Lash Boosting, and then my mascara is the Jordana Best Lash Extreme, and I think that's it. I have been using the um, City Cosmetics Eyelash Growth stuff, so my lashes are extra long, but they were long originally, I think, from the Latisse that I was using, which I actually use CarePost which is just like Latisse, but cheaper because it's, it's, well, let me just tell you really quick. So Latisse was actually Carepros, which is a glaucoma medication for people who, have, Jimmy doesn't know this, for people who have, for people who have glaucoma, I'll tell you since you're sitting right here. And so they would put it in their eyes. Well, they were finding that people who had glaucoma were using this medication. They had really long lashes. So they repackaged it as Latisse, bumped up the prices, yeah, and they started selling it just to put on the upper lash line to grow your lashes. Dang, that's so yeah. sick, bro. So we get the glaucoma medication, not Latisse, and we put it on our upper eyelashes. To save some money? Yeah. And it works. There are side effects. You could have discoloration of your eyelids. Your eyes could turn brown. There's like some weird thing. But so far, <laughs> I still have blue eyes and they don't look like why, they're turning why, brown. Why not just have like slightly shorter lashes and not worry about well, it? Well, I think the people whose eyes are turning brown, are they're like the glaucoma patients. And we're just putting it on the top lid and you don't need to do it every day. You can do it every other day. I think people who those things happen, they're using a lot of it. There's I a risk I with everything. Know, I didn't know any of this. <laughs> well... You know, uh, there's a risk when you go get in your car and drive to work every day, but you still do it. <laughs> it's kind of the same thing. All right. Well, it's good talk. <laughs> I got to go work out. Oh, I'm wearing my Irresistible Me extensions, too. Finally, I feel like they blend in good. Blend in good. Finally, I feel like they blend in well with my new haircut. And this necklace is from Primark in London, and then I'm just wearing this tank top from Plato's Closet. <laughs> so hot. Oh, this is brutal. I gotta stop filming. I can't. I can't live. I think I'm wearing various items that are minimum of five years old. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I like to roll. I don't change things very much. You just got your basketball shorts. This is Very really often. faded. This is from Costco. This one? I don't know if yeah. this one is from Costco. All your Ruka stuff is from Costco. Is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do get a lot at Costco. These shorts, I just... This is getting long. <sighs> I'm going to go work out now so that you can go surfing. See what a great wife I am? Yeah, brah. So sick. I've got to get ready for Hawaii. All right, guys, talk to you later. I'll just show you what I added on to my workout. 
today and am like dying. I'm like totally dying right now. I did this Tabata. Let's look here. So this is Suzanne Bowen Fitness. I love her. She's a friend of mine, but she kicks my butt whenever I do her workouts. She does a lot of, um, what is it? Like bar method stuff, but she, if you guys subscribe to her streaming workouts, you will never be without something to do. So let's see here. Search. Are these all Tabata? Okay, look. I did this Tabata for 40 minutes, but then she's added all these other ones too. So this is high, low um, intensity, so it really burns fat. Um, it's a good workout. So I'm trying to do this more often, like th at least three days a week, different HIIT or Tabata workouts, but I haven't talked about her or shown her. I've been doing it, but I just haven't been filming it on my blog. So definitely check her out. She is the best. You guys will absolutely adore her. Promise. No, oh, makes me happy. I finally got to do my Vitacost order. So um, I'm not sure when I'll be able to film an unboxing, but it'll be up eventually. And you guys can see what I got this time. I actually got a few new things and then some oldies and goodies. So... Yeah, I'm gonna dig in right now. Monday, we're going on a staycation day with our friends Becky and Matt and their kids, and we are going to go ride bikes around Coronado. And um, I haven't ridden a bike since junior high. And before junior high, I hadn't ridden a bike since uh, <laughs> I was my kid's age, like nine or something. So that should be interesting. I've been kind of stressed out about what to wear when you ride a bike. <laughs> I decided to go against the uh, spandex, so did Jimmy. He's just going to wear some sport shorts. Basketball shorts, a Costco tank top. <laughs> Drinking outfit. my protein shake right now. I'm wearing just a like, fedora type hat. I think I got this at Plato's Closet. I have my Twisted Silver Attitude necklace and just this tank top from Forever 21 and then I just have shorts on. Really old shorts, I've had them for a long time. I think I got them at Charlotte Russe. And yeah, so we'll try and do some filming of our day and show you around. Uh, I worked out this morning, I did a 45 minute Tabata. Oh, I showed a video of it. I did the Suzanne Bowen Tabata. So I feel good. I feel like I'm ready to be active. Do you have any deep thoughts? I don't have any deep thoughts. Although, I think when I get on that bike, I'm going to build a sweet jump with like a piece of plywood. And You're going to have Chloe know. attached to you. I know. We're going to go off on awesome jump. Oh, my makeup. I'm trying the Tarte. Amazonian clay foundation today. I don't know if it's the right shade for me. I'm like staring at it in the light. It might be a little bit light, but I think with some bronzer and you know blush and stuff, it can warm it up. But I do really like the the look of it. It goes on really, really beautifully, and it's soft, like incredibly soft. And then I'm I grabbed the wrong mascara, so my my lashes are all crazy Zsa Zsa Gabor style right now. It's a dried out Mary Kay lash love, I think. And then my blush is the Wet n Wild Heather Silk. And so I just have foundation, my blush, mascara, and then my lips are um, the City Cosmetics, that new liquid lipstick. And then I put a little bit of this L'Oreal it's pink rebellion over it just to give it some moisture so that's what's going on right now and we will check in with you later bye staycation time getting our bikes ready you're a little taller huh yeah. okay watch out i'm a little bit nervous he's tired taller. he's doing a good job Hi. assigning bikes yeah jimmy are you excited yes are you kind of wishing you had worn speedos i'm gonna get a piece of plywood and build a <laughs> sweet jump and go off of it like so Jimmy, you're gonna have Sophia with you. Okay. Hey, and then the this gears, are you familiar with how to shift gears? Alright, we just took a little bike break. I did it. I totally biked and I didn't fall. 
can't say that my heart wasn't racing a bit, but I did it. And I actually want to buy a bike now, but look at how beautiful this is. We just love where we live. I grew up in Seattle, Washington, where it was gray and rainy, so I just, I never take this for granted. Not ever. And then, there's the crew. We're making a plan. We're going to go up a hill, apparently. I just had to show you our mail, or my mail, I guess, for the day. I got from Amazon, finally, my face shavers. Don't use these for your eyebrows, but use them for your fuzzy face, because that's what they're the best for, is getting off all that hair on your face. So, got those, and then I got a little goodie sent to me from Twisted Silver, and um, this is, I think this just launched this week, but it's a convertible piece that you can wear as a necklace, you can kind of double it up for a shorter necklace. You can wear it as a wraparound bracelet. It has this little charm that you can move around. So I'm excited to play with that and, um, and see how I like it best. I'll probably take a picture and put it on Instagram. So that is what came today. Fun. I love goodies in the mail. It just makes my day. All right, you guys, so that's it for our vlog this week. I will see you guys next week.